so welcome back to yet another video <coughs> and in this video I'm gonna show you how to take off the roof up holster of roof liner or however you wanna call it so and this is Ford Fiesta MK8 2019 or 20 something like that and it's an ST line so the roof is black and everything around it it's it's kind of black so yeah let me let me try and show you uh, what you need to do to replace to replace that if you need to replace because mostly it's not that common to to have a need to replace or remove it but sometimes yeah if you want to make your fie or normal fiesta like business titanium and stuff like that a little bit different yeah this this is the way to go so uh, basically so basically you should start by removing these outer gums around the all doors because this is gonna be in your way that's for sure uh, be gentle with all that because you really don't want to break you really don't want to break anything because everything in Ford is kind of way overpriced so yeah this is kind of oh the sun the sun is bad so uh, this kind of two or three things in one video that you can catch a break so yeah as you can see over right here once you take out the first part the rest follows easily so it's not that big a problem you just start doing this around so uh, I, I mean, it says for performance, but it's a regular Fiesta ST line. Okay, it's 1-0 EcoBoost, so not really a regular Fiesta, but yeah, maybe start from here. Yeah, so once you start from here, it's just easy to take rest of it out. I hope I hope this will help you so I usually put them all in the back I usually put them all in the back this should be a little bit longer video because there is really lots of work to be done over here just to get to the place where you are even able, even able to unscrew it so yeah as you can see here it's best to start from the corners because there is most as you can see here there is most place so you can put your hand inside so once you're done all these You can start from the inside. So let's see. Uh, this one is first start, and it's always just on click. I did already take this out, so yeah. And as you can see over here, one clip, second clip, and these are the smaller clips. There is one thing that annoys me a lot, and this is it's this one. So it goes over here it goes over here in this hole and you should just you should just uh, click it I mean you need to turn it around like this so you can pull it out next step that we're gonna do uh, is this sun so you need to best way is to start like this so there is a screw over here another screw over here same goes on this side as well 
and this one I will show you as well so let me get the tools and then we uh, unscrew these so once you open up it's a uh, Torx 20 I believe yeah it's 20 so take it out there is another one over here and I'm not even sure if you can see yeah another one is over here and when you unscrew it it stays in your hand or on your machine so next up after you did unscrew it there is probably some electricity inside because most of the times there is so like this uh, and yeah like this so here you see the electricity because when you open up there is when you open up there is uh, the lights are here so that's the first one second one is kind of the same uh, I'm not even sure that because it will take too long on this video it's gonna be like half an hour so uh, basically what you want to do with this lightning middle lightning I believe it's somewhere over here not really 100% sure maybe it's over here I did make a video about that but it was a long time yeah it's must be on the sides let me take it out and we show you so one holder is here and one is here so uh, when you put it back it goes like this I don't know if you can see so there are here two pins over here so you put it back you need somewhere around here so in the middle of this and in the back so I hope this will help you when you're doing it after that you need to unplug the electricity there is lots of wiring here on the roof liner or up poster whatever you want to call it so that's the and now this is incorporated with the, that so you need to take this one screw I mean these are two screws so these two screws are the things that is holding it all together after that I will take this one out and then we start on the B pillars on the B pillars so yeah so once again two screws Torx 25 You unscrew them, put them aside, same here, uh, maybe close up just in case and so when it's in a normal position like this it's just easy to plug it out. After that it's this little electricity that's holding it all in place and that's about that for this one. Now to the harder parts of this, you need to take all of this out, so this pillow and this one, and there is one screw over here that's holding it in the place, let me show you, so there is this one, again I believe it's Torx 25, after that it's just this holding it here, so Let's start with the... And it's not that easy. As it looks like. So... Because there is holders here and there. After that... You should be taking out this. So, uh, the thing about this... Yeah, so like this, so you don't need to take everything apart. That's that first first one. Now let me see. Maybe you don't even need to take that. 
if I put this down yeah so yeah don't need you really don't need to take that out my mistake after that we have this one over here I believe under under here is again Torx 25 but my little screwdriver can find it right now second so with the little screwdriver and a help of Torx 20 you take that out same goes for the other side and one more thing you have to do is unplug this one out should not be that hard should not be that hard so that's the this side and i believe from what i recall yeah cup holder here so yeah that's about that after you take that one out we move to this side again oh, in a second so we go to the other side and again we have this you take it out you take it out again here that's about that one after that it's just this holder should not be that hard there are some clips holding it like you can see here there is that one and I believe another one somewhere around here so one clip here another clip over here and some more clips over there now I need to take out now I need to take out that I believe it's what was it not really sure right now uh, from that yeah to, to these two torques 25 I believe there is one and there is another one and after that only thing that it's holding it is the wiring it's the wiring that is all around here so this this wiring and the water line that connects over here so take this this water line out and the wiring this is the wiring that holds in place on this side same goes on the other side so we need to be Kind of. Yeah, so this is the wiring that you need to take off. Wiring. And that's about that now we just need to go it up and down up and down so let me and there is one more water line over here so that's about that now the job is to take it out so uh, 
need two hands for this. But let me. I mean, it's possible and it's doable to take it from the outside, from the backside. But most easy way, if you don't have a front windshield from the front, is the best way to take it out. But uh, let me a little bit start. So you should take it like this. It's most easy way to take it apart. And there we have it, the roof liner. The roof liner. Uh, should put this back in here, just in case. That's from this one. So yeah, I hope this helped. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and follow. And uh, see you guys in the next one. So till next one.